Today I have a brand new subscription box I've never had before. I've never had this box in my hands. But what's super exciting is I actually received this as a courtesy box from Pro Wrestling Loot. So very appreciative of sending me a care package of this month's Pro Wrestling Loot subscription box. So let's check this out because I'm super excited to see what this one's about. Pro Wrestling Loot. So I'll make sure in the description box to leave a direct link to this company if you want to get yourself one of these boxes. In the past several weeks, we've had a couple of wrestling subscription boxes that have been bought out and the amount of boxes available now from other companies is getting kind of sparse. So to have some new companies come around, I'm excited about that because there's nothing like a wrestling subscription box of who knows what could be in this thing. So I'm I'm going in blind. I'm not sure what to expect, but I actually have looked at this website in the past. So I'm gonna give you my honest opinion of what I think of pro wrestling loot. So that's awesome. Okay, I didn't want to keep this a total mystery for myself because I don't even know what I'm really reaching into, but here's an item in here. It's something that is ultra cool. But let's start with a, looks like a t-shirt. Let's see, we got baby gorilla size. And what, what we got, what we got? So it's like a Columbia, or not Columbia, like a royal blue color t-shirt. Oh, from my... Camera lens looks like we got the Macho Man on here. That's cool. It's a very clean shirt. Basic, not a whole lot to it. It has like just enough on there that you know who the graphic is. T-shirt quality, it feels nice. The brand is, uh, there's no brand. There's only a, like a T-shirt size. So not sure which brand of shirt it is, but it feels nice. Um, not sure if it's a Hanes or a Gildan or whatever, but cool. Okay. T-shirt. I like it. I'm more of a black, navy blue, grays, those kind of colors. Um, I mean, blue is not my favorite color, but I like the graphics and it's not a bright big bird yellow T-shirt. So I like the shirt. It's cool. Next, let's grab this thing. We have a collector's exclusive pin. I should probably know who this is of, I'm guessing, but I'm drawing a total blank of who this pin is of right now. A total blank. I don't know, comment below if you know who this pin's of because I feel dumb right now. But yeah, monthly pin, okay. <clears throat> Next item. Oh, let's <clears throat> let's do this. Looks like we have a collector's like a like a baseball card of almost dropped it of Razor Ramon Scott Hall. This says Pro Wrestling Loot Series Three Trading Card Machismo. So that's kind of neat. If you're a collector of sports cards, this actually would be really cool to get autographed. That'd be neat. Next, let's do this thing next. Like we, it looks like we got two things left. You know what I gotta do with this? We have a freaking Lucha Libre mask. Lucha Libre. Okay. You know what I gotta do now, right? And there we go. Look at that. Oh, let me get the uh, the beard sticking out a little bit better better than that. There, <laughs> awesome. So we got a lucha lucha libre mask. 
pretty good quality. It's nice and soft. It's got your nose holes and your eye hole and your mouth hole. Well, it's everything you need in a mask. <laughs> it's ultra cool. So, you know what we gotta do now? We're gonna keep the mask on. We gotta keep reviewing this box. Next, we have, actually the last thing, this is why I saw when I first opened this box, was this. It looks awesome. We have a Kamala. Looks like a vinyl figure that has been autographed by Kamala. Let me give you that 360 view. See what we got going on here. That is cool. I love collecting autographed items, autographed memorabilia, collectibles, and get something like this in, in a box, I think is ultra cool. I really like it. This will go nicely into my autograph collection. Ooh, it's kinda, if you're not used to wearing a mask, it feels weird on your face. If you're not used to it. So it looks like it actually came, the back of it has a pro wrestling loot authentication sticker. Then here is a Pro Wrestling Loot Authentic Signature Certificate of Authenticity card that came with the Kamala autographed vinyl figure. It says, Certificate of Authenticity. This Certificate of Authenticity attests to the fact that the accompanied autograph is authentic and was witnessed by Pro Wrestling Loot. It is important that you do not remove this hologram right there, which is the most important document for guaranteed authenticity. Jeff Dino, owner, ProWrestlingLoot.com. This is probably one of those stickers that pretty much is like super adhesive and doesn't come off no matter what. So yeah, I think this is ultra cool. I would really be curious if Pro Wrestling Loot plans to keep doing autograph collectibles like this because doing items like this in your monthly subscription box is like freaking home run. I mean, just imagine the possibilities because this is their own exclusive vinyl line right there that, that they made. So. It's like their version of like a Funko Pop kind of. So I'm gonna be very curious to know if they plan to keep doing ones like this every single month of different wrestlers, current, retired, who knows what, independent. So that'd be ultra cool. So when we get in this box all together, do a small little recap. Oh, here's a card in the box. Oh, it's like there's actually, you could get three different t-shirts. You could get a t-shirt in black, blue, or gray. Of course, I would have loved to have the black one. My second choice would be the gray one. My last choice would be the blue one just because of my style. I wear lots of blacks, and if it's not black, it's usually like gray or navy blue. So there actually was three different colored t-shirts that you could get. And here's a picture of Kamala autographing the vinyl figures. And then you've got your Wrestling Luce Libre Mask by Wrestling Legend Solar. Or Solar. Exclusive pin, number three in the series. I still don't know who this pin is of, it doesn't say. But it's just exclusive pin, number three in the series. So I'm curious, who's this pin of? I don't know. And then exclusive trading card of Areza Ramon. So Pro Wrestling Loot. This is actually their February 2019 Mystery Wrestling Box. So my honest opinion, what did I think? I think the Kamala autograph figure is exactly the kind of items that I love getting in my boxes because I collect autographed collectibles. I think this mask is ultra cool. This thing is freaking awesome. But it, it'll, it takes time to get used to wearing this thing. It feels weird on you. And then the t-shirt, it's cool. I would have loved to have had this t-shirt in black. But, you know, it's just a gamble. So anyway, that's what we got. So I'll link direct links below to Pro Wrestling Loot. What did I think? I liked it. For the value, it was good. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Hopefully I can get my hands on some more of these pro wrestling loot subscription boxes. And if I can, I'll bring them to you direct on YouTube. Lucha Libre, out.